It's Friday the 13th. What could go wrong? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Our novel, The Lost Causes of Bleak Creek, comes out October 29th. It's scary, it's funny. We created a very special live event to go along with this release. It's called Bleak Creek Conversations and each ticket comes with a copy of the book. Copy of the book. And there are just a handful left and you can see all dates and cities at bleakcreek.com. Mm-hmm, and happy Friday the 13th. It's a bad day. It's a day where bad luck hides around every corner. It could be a guy in a hockey mask and stylish coveralls. It could be your best friend who knows a deep, dark secret about you or it could be nothing at all. So this really bad day, we're gonna watch some videos of people having really bad days or almost having a bad day, you'll see. It's time for, do things go mysteriously right or do they go gentle into that good night? Okay, we're gonna look at some videos where one of two things is gonna happen. Someone who is tempting fate will either A, have something terrible happen to them mm -hmm. or B, luck is gonna be on their side and they'll emerge unscathed. Uh, we have to predict which one it will be. And apparently we're tempting fate ourselves because if we guess wrong, I'm told that something terrible and unexpected is going to happen to us and only the mythical crew knows what it is. I can't wait to find out. Let's see the first clip. Okay. What on earth? So that's a like a quad. It's like a, it's a four wheeler with a freaking powered with parachute. A, with a, it's like it's with a propeller behind it. Yeah, I mean this is this is what I've always wanted to do. Not with a four wheeler involved. Okay, so, so I, I have a lot. Our of, options are okay. Everything turns out okay, or no way, something bad happens. I really want this to work, and so I'm going to say everything is okay because I want this. I want this type of flight, like ATVs in the sky. <clears throat> Most likely something horrible is gonna happen because of all the ingredients. I'm wondering if it has anything to do with the guy in the foreground or him just crashing into that building in the background. But it's gonna be bad. Let's see it. Up, going up, going up, going up. The guy's turned around, he's he's giving up. Oh, oh, pull, yeah, up, pull, yeah, up, yeah. pull up, 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 uh, you got it wrong and uh, you got punished. Uh, is that guy okay? <laughs> yeah, I, got, I was gonna chime in and say that chime everybody in. in the car is apparently okay, but the, that looked really bad. The guy on the ground who was taking pictures at first, he is not okay because he missed the entire thing. He's like, all he's, right, I've seen enough. He's hating himself <laughs> forever. Oh he, my he, gosh. he turned around and is the video. All right, let's see another oh, one. I should have known. Ryan, you ready? No, I'm okay, this is classic not. chase. <laughs> I love the guy who said, I might hit you, I might not. Yeah, that's pretty much <laughs> one of two ways it's gonna go. It, I'm I'm sticking with okay again. I, I, I feel like this is something that if I was having a really good day and everything was going right, I might attempt to try this with someone who was willing, if you were willing to, to do this, I would be willing to try it. This can't turn out well. I mean, there's there's so many fingers to hit. And speaking from experience, uh, it's difficult to hit a bullseye. Yeah. <laughs> Let's watch it. I might hit you, I might not, all right? All right. Hey, nothing but a thing. Oh! Oh, whoa, whoa. It ain't nothing but a thing, y'all. <laughs> well, you got gonged. I, you love gongs. Yeah, <laughs> that, was, that was pleasant. It was more symbolish than gongish. Hold on, I gotta see that again. Can we play? Is there it, any way to do that says, again? She says it ain't nothing but a thing. I might hit you. I might not. All right. All right. Come on, it ain't nothing but a thing. Oh! <laughs> I love the reaction of everyone there. Oh! But you know, but but you, it's, it's you, a gleeful. You, oh. you gotta admit, she's pretty cool, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah she yeah, is yeah. cool stuff. You wanna know something about me? <laughs> <laughs> like a woman who takes it in the hand. All right, here we go. Show another video. Oh, cats, Rhett. It's a cat video. Oh no, oh no. Now, is that cat heavy enough to turn over that chest of drawers? At this point, I have to go with okay just because I have done that every time. But what do you hope happens? Come on, be real. 
I, like I said, even though I have been hypnotized to try to love these devil creatures and it didn't work, uh, I don't harbor just unnecessary, unfounded ill will towards all cats for no reason at all. I mean, this cat, I don't know this cat. Maybe he's capable of getting up there and peacefully getting himself into the chest of drawers, which I believe happened. I think it does fall, but he's totally okay because you can't show us a, a video of a cat getting maimed. I mean. <laughs> right, yeah, you can, you can do that with a person, but not a cat. All right, so play it. Oh, here comes a drawer. Now does the drawer shut because that would be awesome. Oh, get your tail in. Oh, the drawer shut! <laughs> what? Okay. What? That did more for me than any of that cat hypno cat hypnosis. How did the cat Was there fishing line involved? You know, cats are smart, man. Is it was that like Rotoscoping or something? I don't know how. Well, it's not, I mean, it's not as amazing as you're making it seem. How did the cat do that? Like, what's the cat pulling on inside of the drawer? Anything that's not the drawer to pull it back in. <laughs> the the chest part of Listen, the drawers. Don't, don't. I mean, I'm just, I'm not trying to spoil it for don't you, pee but. pee in my cornflakes, man. <laughs> All right, we both got okay, that one so right. No got... punishment. Okay. Next one. Oh, we got celebrating. You know something goes wrong here. Okay. Laptop sale, one hundred thirty nine dollars. What am I supposed to be looking at? Those balloons, I believe. Uh, I think they go directly into the power lines, and since there's helium in them, they burst uh, into a small but impressive explosion. And then they fall on a car, which then catches fire. You know, no place other than L.A. have I gone down the street and seen cars just on fire. About every three weeks. I'll just, see a full car. Just completely on just fire. Just completely on fire. What is that about? Why like, does that Welcome to LA. I mean, come on out and see us, guys. Car's on fire. I yeah. didn't pay nothing for it. Yeah. Um, I mean, if this is okay. Why did they film it? Why did they, well, that, I th okay, I think that would be funny. If it's just like, it just goes. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. Uh, we'll see. Oh, God. That was a big. Get in the car! Get in the car! Get in the car! What are you? What are you? <laughs> the... ah! mm. Ice. Hey. Versace buoyant. That was worth it. That was worth every second of that. Oh my goodness. Do you think that they they stuck around? I think they got out of Dodge because that's that's highly illegal, man. You shouldn't be putting that stuff on the internet. You probably get arrested or something. Okay, so are we? Does that tie us up? No, I'm up by one. And oh, let's no. see the next clip. <laughs> okay. I mean, this is a party atmosphere. We got some long glass noodles. So she's either gonna slurp these and die completely down, or choke in, and die. In the in the process of slurping, they're going to stop. They're going to get stuck. Maybe they'll come out her nose. You know how sometimes you'll slurp, cough, blow, and noodle come out? I think this is gonna go bad in that particular way. Well, that makes more sense than saying that she's just gonna slurp them. Why would we be share why would you care about this video if slurping was the only thing that happened? Because they just searched what? woman eating noodles and they found a video with 15 views. I'm gonna go out on a limb though and say that this is just a signature slurp. <laughs> Nothing, that, nothing goes wrong. It's gonna be all. a long slurp. It could be amazing. <laughs> oh! <laughs> wow! It's like she had a. Oh hey, hey! Don't involve me in this. What was what was that? The punishments get worse. You just got splashed in the face with water. Yeah. And I got splashed on the arm with water. Yeah, it's just the position you're in. Sorry. Um, <laughs> it seemed like everyone watching her slurp the noodles expected that that was gonna happen. It must, have been, it must have been laced with something. Oh, you think it was like super sour or something? Yeah, maybe. Do we know? We don't know. Next video. No, we don't. Camera's rolling. Oh gosh. Oh no. Oh my goodness. Ah! I can tell this is gonna be just fine. <laughs> <laughs> I know, seriously, gosh. I can tell, first of all, 
this isn't just some 25 year old redneck. This is like a man who's lived a long time and figured out how to do this. He has a, a little short wave sport. Like you can see the engineering in the ladder that he's built into his pool. Everything about this is gonna be perfect. Okay, 100%. He does look like a college professor from the waist up. Yep, right. From the waist down, he looks like a kayak. Yep. Uh, but from top to bottom. Or a kayak. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I thought that was I thought that was the joke yeah, that you yeah, were gonna yeah, make. Yeah, that would have been good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when you made it it wasn't good. Yeah, yeah. From the waist up, he looks like a British dude. From the waist down he looks like a kayak. Uh, I can't, college, college professor was better. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Um put it all together now. <laughs> that's high up, man. And that's a rickety He's got a rant. wave sport, man. Bad. Gonna go bad. Play it. Uh, inch forward. Oh my God. See, he's like, oh, of course. That was a sharp. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Oh, man, I tell you, being in the line of fire, this stuff is. That was a sharp turn at the end when he hit the pool. Yeah, he was. you can only do that in a wave sport. <laughs> now this stuff, now Lucas, this is all fun and games, but. This stuff stains, man. <laughs> like my kids, my kids silly string the whole back uh, fence at my house, and I had to repaint the whole thing. <laughs> Next video. <laughs> oh goodness. Green means go. Green, Green means go. <laughs> <laughs> so he's punching. He's punching cactus, and now he's on a car shirtless with a bandana around his neck. I think he's well protected. Eye protection. Um, I think he's so well protected that this is gonna go just fine. I I think that he knows something that we don't, Link. Well, I know that I'm already <laughs> winning, so I'm glad you, you answered first, because that means that if I agree with you, I definitely win, but we might both be punished. Hmm. There's no way this ends well but I want to win a game because that doesn't happen a lot. So I'm saying okay, for well some- Okay, then I'll switch. No, you can't switch. Yeah, I can I switch any, yeah. Come on, man, where's your backbone? You think it's okay? Just go with okay then. Well, then I'm going with no way. It's bad. I almost got you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, All right. Uh, no, no, you, come on, man. He's got it. Whatever you do, I'm doing the opposite. That's my official position. Whatever your answer is, mine is the opposite. There's no That's my only chance way. to tie. There's no way this is okay. This is ends badly. I think he's gonna be okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see it. Green means go. Oh! Uh, uh, <laughs> pull my legs over. Fucking pull my legs over. Zach, help me now. <laughs> help me now. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's okay. <laughs> I mean, he's not dead. He's not okay, man. I'm disappointed in you, Rhett. <laughs> David's disappointed in you. <laughs> and so am I. And that means, Link, you win a lucky charm. Oh, congratulations, Link. <laughs> Eat it now before it gets cold. <laughs> Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Martha. I am Mike. And we are on the in the Rocky Mountains at 12,005 feet elevation. It's time, time to, to spin, spin the, the wheel, wheel of mythicality. Wow, <laughs> talk about Rocky Mountain High. <laughs> that woman's happy to be there. <laughs> Click the top link to watch us look at some real life lucky charms in Good Mythical More. <laughs> and to find out where the Wheel of Mythicality is gonna land. I think it's just the altitude. Hi. So many snotes, so little snotebooks. Unless of course you venture over to mythical.com and pick up a bunch of mythical snotebooks.